YouTube. What the fuck is good? It's your boy Rich, aka Mike Trunks. Welcome back to the club channel. Y'all see I'm wearing my, my robe today. I'm cozy as shit. I'm trying to be the next Black Hugh Hefner. But before I start, I just want to let anyone new coming to my channel, all my old subscribers and all my new subscribers, I appreciate everyone for taking the time to check out my channel and view my content. And for all the positive feedback I've gotten so far, continue to give it so I can find ways to improve and grow my channel. Um, before I start the topic for the day, I just want to say that this is actually a follow-up video of the video I made on Stop Letting Women Use You. I think it might have been episode six. So if you haven't already, go check that out. And I also want to let everyone know that I'm not judging anyone for the topic for the day because at the end of the day, we're all fucking grown and you're going to do whatever you want to do. But I really feel like I needed to make this video to wake some of you guys up and shed some light on some of your situations. And without further ado on my fancy shit, the topic for today is y'all are paying for pussy? Like, the like y'all are really paying for pussy. Pussy is free. A lot of you guys don't know this. Pussy is free for certain niggas and certain people. And... I talk about how to become that person on my channel and on in the content I create. And there is three ways to pay for pussy. Some of you guys do it literally. Some of you pay X amount of dollars for X amount of time for pussy, for head, whatever. I don't really know how it works because I've never paid for pussy. The second way is some of you guys do it unconsciously. And a lot of people do this. That's why I made this video. And when I say unconsciously, I mean that it's an unconscious transaction. And I'll talk about that further in the video. So keep watching to find out what I mean. And the third way is the best way. My personal favorite and the, if I can, this is the only way I'll get pussy for the rest of my life. And that is to pay in your time and invest your emotions. And when I say invest your emotions, I say that, you give her some type of feeling or make her feel some type of way in that moment. And that's important because women are emotional creatures. So you have to find out how to capture their mind to fully have them. So for all the women out there selling pussy, I'm not knocking your hustle. I'm not judging you. I'm not slut shaming you. Because the sad truth is for every pussy, no matter what color, size, shape, whatever, every pussy out there, there's some sucker that's willing to pay for it. And some women fuck so many niggas for free and fuck so many niggas with money or broke niggas and they're still broke themselves. They think, shit, I might as well get something from it. So shit, do you pay your bills, sell your pussy because a lot of women are glorifying that now anyway. So that's some people's role models for the generation that we're creating. Again, I'm not I'm not judging you because at the end of the day, if I could sell my dick and get paid to fuck women, not be a porn star, but just to pay to fuck women in general and be a jiggle over some shit, I would. Like, the fuck, that's like the ideal job. So... <clears throat> I made this video because you need to be conscious that women are manipulative and they'll find all types of ways to manipulate you. And I'll do a video on that later. But the most common way a woman manipulates a man throughout time is using her pussy. Pussy is like a drug. All women are taught at a young age the power of their pussy and how they can use it to their advantage, to uh, get things that they want or just to get things they want in general. Um, earlier in the video, if you're still watching, I appreciate you sticking around this long. I talked about how some of you guys unconsciously pay for pussy and it's a transaction that you're unaware of. And this is what I mean for that. 
will buy that. When you first start talking to a girl, this isn't for everyone. She'll give you uh she'll give you a sample. Like I said, pussy's like pussy's like a drug. It's probably one of the most powerful drugs. She'll give you a sample to reel you in and get you hooked. And then she'll condition you like Pavlov, uh, Pavlo, whatever his name is, and the dog experiment. And create strings attached for you getting the pussy. That's a transaction. You do this and she gives you the pussy. If you don't do that, you don't get the pussy. And a lot of you guys aren't aware of that. And if you don't know who Pavlo or Pavlov is, Google that shit and go read the book. Take a psychology class and you can see the correlation of what I'm talking about. If you find yourself not getting pussy unless you do stuff for her or buy her things and before that in some point of time you're getting pussy for free she already traps you bro you you're already in her you're already in the palm of her fucking hand bro and you don't even know it that's why i made this video because i talk to a lot of people and they talk about their relationship with their girlfriend and it's like dog you're paying for pussy nigga like and the truth is if you were one of these dudes that are paying for pussy your girl's most likely cheating on you with the dude who she really finds sexually attractive because she's just using you to get stuff out of her bro you don't really make her pussy wet the things you do for her make her pussy wet so some examples of this are you paying for paying for her to get her hair done you buying her stuff, you buying her gifts, you giving her drugs or alcohol, you paying her bills, you you paying, I know a nigga that bought a woman a car after he got in, in an accident, after insurance claim or some shit. If you're doing any of these things to get pussy or to keep getting pussy, you are a trick, beta male, blue pill, simp ass nigga, and you need to wake the fuck up, dog, like, I'm trying not to get mad, I'm trying not to yell, I got a cold and shit, but, <clears throat> y'all niggas are making me sick, man, like, we're creating a generation of beta male pussy ass niggas, man, we gotta, we gotta boss the fuck up, and just work on ourselves, so you're not one of these niggas in the videos that I'm talking about. <coughs> Like I said before, the only thing you should use to pay for pussy is your time and invest your emotions, dog, to make her feel some type of way and to give her a feeling in the moment. That's why in the past I fucked another nigga's wife or I fucked another nigga's girl because first she was using her husband for security nine times out of ten and because he was using stuff to get pussy or to capture or to keep her attention and not making her feel a certain type of way and you gotta be careful with that because i'm gonna do a video on uh validating and over validating women but again that's a topic for another day the quickest way well i shouldn't say quick because it's not going to be quick but the the best way to get free pussy is self-improvement bro Taking the red pill, become an alpha male, so you can use hypergamy to your advantage and work on yourself enough that you're attracting all the the women and people in your life that you want, and you don't have to settle for the ugly the ugly woman. Well, like I said, everyone's beautiful, but the people that you find less attractive or aesthetically pleasing in your eyes, and you actually get to choose the woman that you want to fuck, bro, and you're not just settling for some some random joint that wants to give you the pussy man because like i said at the end of the day women are gonna fuck who they want for free because that person gets their pussy wet and they're gonna use beta male simp ass pussy ass niggas like some of y'all watching this and have y'all wrapped around their fingers to use you for your resources and I'm not trying to offend anyone, but some you got tough love is true, man. Like when I was simping, 
my niggas told me, my mentally, my mentee Dre, shout out to my fucking nigga Dre, man. <clears throat> he always let me know when I was simping, bro. He's like, nigga, you simping over some pussy, bro. You got to chill. So that's the topic for the day. I hope this was able to help some of you guys out in some way, shape, or form. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And share my content so I can grow my channel, get more views, and <clears throat> reach my goal of 100 subscribers. In the future, I'm going to be uh, transitioning to this into a podcast as well. I want to have special guests and really just grow this shit and see how big it can get. So be the fuck easy. Stop simping. Take this red pill. Improve on yourself and be the fuck easy. Peace.